Right. The next problem that we have is balancing redox reaction in acidic uh, or basic medium. So we have here zinc plus permanganate to give you uh, manganese dioxide and zinc hydroxide. So the first thing that we're going to do is we assign the oxidation number for each of them. So we all know elemental uh, element, okay? Or uh, <clears throat> element in the elemental form that's zero. So this one, uh, negative two times four. So that would make it seven. Okay, and then this one, negative two times uh, a two. So that will make this four. And this one, you have a negative one times four, you have an excess of that. So you will have at least two as the oxidation number. So based on this, we could say uh, one of them undergo reduction. Okay, and, 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 and this is uh, the permanganate. Okay, producing MnO2 and the one that undergo oxidation. Okay, we could say that's the zinc producing zinc hydroxide. So the next thing that we're going to do, we balance the element in it. So manganese and manganese is okay. Now oxygen here has two. Uh, here you have what we called four. So the idea is for every oxygen, you add water. So you need two water here, okay? Since you add uh, hydrogen there, so you're going to put there four hydrogen plus. Okay, so we could say it is now balanced. Now for the other side that we have here, you have sink here, sink here. So you introduce what? Four uh, oxygen. So if you're going to uh, what we call <clears throat> introduce here the four oxygen. So that means you have to introduce here four water, which also introduce eight uh, H plus. So that means you have to if we're going to look at this, there's four already here. So you just add four H plus. Now the elements on both sides are now what we call balance. So the next thing that we're going to do is look at the charges. So if you're going to look at this one, MnO4 minus plus four H2O, or oh no, four, four, four H plus, sorry, producing. MnO2 plus 2H2O. So if you're going to look at this, there's uh, a zero total charge on the product side. So for this one here, you get what? A, a negative one and four times uh, plus, so that's neg uh, positive four. So you have here overall, uh, you need to add at least three electrons to make the charge zero, okay? The same charge as the product side. Now on the other one, you have what? Sink 4H2O doesn't have any charge, okay? So it's zero charge on this point. But if you're going to look at here, so you have what? Sink 2 minus plus 4H plus. So you have a 2 minus and an H plus. So that means there's a positive 2. Okay, so the way that we're going to do here is we're going to add, uh, if I'm not mistaken, two electrons. So that the charge will also be negative. Now, if you're going to look at here, the charges on both sides are already uh, balanced. So the, ne the next thing that we're going to do is to balance the electron. So you have three electron here, two electron here. So the way that we're going to do it is we cross multiply. So we multiply this by two and then multiply this by three. So in doing that, this now becomes six, two, this becomes eight, this becomes two, and this becomes four. Okay. So in doing this also, this becomes three, this becomes three times four, 12. Okay. So this is three, this becomes 12, and this becomes six. So overall, if we're going to look at it, right now we balance already the exchange of the electron. 
there's now six on both sides. And what we're going to do is to cancel common substances or species on both sides. So uh, for instance, you have 8H plus here, you have what we call 12, okay? So in doing that, so that means this is canceled out and this now only have four. And then you have water here, this is four and this is 12. So you cancel out, this now becomes uh, what we call eight, okay? So you bring down everything that is uh, available after canceling them up. So this is what you have so far. So you have two MnO2 plus three C <clears throat> OH4. Uh, I think I made my mistake that, 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 that should be on that side. Two minus, and then you have the four H plus. Now, as you could see here, the next thing that we're going to do is make sure balance each element on both sides. So you have two manganese here, two manganese. Uh, for water, you have two times four, that's eight. Eight plus eight, that's 16. So two times two here, that's four. Uh, plus three times four, okay, that is uh, what we call 16, okay? The same side as the, the other one. You have three sinks here, you have three sinks, and then for the hydrogen, you have eight here. So here you have, uh, Eight times two, that's 16. So you have here three times four, that's 12 plus four, you have 16. So all elements are what we call uh, <clears throat> balance. So the next thing that we're going to do is the charge. So two times negative one. So you have a negative two on this side. And here you have three times negative two, that's six plus positive four. So you have negative, uh, or, uh, negative two. So both size now are now balanced. So this is, we could say, the acidic uh, <clears throat> balance chemical, balance redox reaction in acidic uh, medium. So if you want to make it basic, all you need to do is you introduce a hydroxide. So if you introduce four hydroxide here, you're going to introduce also four hydroxide. So what will happen to this one? They become into four water. So when they become four water, you have what we call eight here. So they cancel out here, leaving you this one with four. And once again, you're going to uh, determine the elements on both sides. So you have two manganese here, two manganese, and then for the oxygen, you have what? Uh, this is uh, two times four, so that's eight. Okay, plus four, that's 12, plus another four, Okay, that is what we call 16 oxygen. So here you have two times two, that's four. Okay, and then three times four, that is what we call 12. So you have 16 oxygen. Okay, now for the hydrogen, you have four here and four times two, that's eight. So you have 12 hydrogen. So in this side, you have three times four, that's also 12 hydrogen. Okay, now for the sink, you have what? Three sink here, three sink here. Now for the charge, you have what? Positive two, okay? Uh, and uh, no, not positive two, negative two here, and then negative uh, four. So overall you have negative six on one side. So here three times negative two, so it's also negative six. So if we're going to look at the basic uh, condition, so this is the, balance redox reaction to 2MnO2 plus 3 sink or 2 minus. So this is the one in basic, okay?